Well, it's the American warship that you can actually explore on. John Bartel here in Vallejo make a little pit stop at the Landing Craft Support Museum. Guns, guns, and more guns. When troops in World War II needed some protection, they got behind the USS LCS-102. For tonnage ship, it was more heavily armed than a battleship. The Yankee Dollar, as it was nicknamed, was designed to give soldiers cover when they stormed enemy beaches. In a pinch, these ships could motor up on the sand and unleash a hellfire of rockets and mortars. Only about 130 of these highly effective boats were built, but after the war, all were scrapped, except for this one. Well, they're like beer cans. They were built for purpose, and then the Navy was done with them. Gordon Stutrid is part of a group of veterans that helped save the ship from a boatyard in Thailand. When they got it home, they docked it at Mare Island and turned it into a museum. Gotta watch your head on this boat. Unlike most museums, the Landing Craft Support Museum encourages all visitors to explore and touch things. This kind of reminds me of like uh, what you saw in the Titanic movie. The Yankee Dollar had a crew of about 70 people, and they all lived in pretty cramped quarters. They kind of pack you in here like sardines. Well, they had a full 18 inches. <laughs> If you thought the sleeping quarters were cramped, wait till you see the bathroom. What, what, what are these things that we're sitting on here? Well, this is a three-banger toilet. It had salt water coming in one end and over the side out the other end. Huh. Some other noteworthy places to explore include the radar room, the captain's quarter, and the mess hall. Well, you have to be nice to the cook because he'll put your mashed potatoes there, your ice cream here, and the gravy on the ice cream. There's definitely more room on the top deck, and this is where you get to play with all the guns, which are decommissioned, of course. This looks like something Arnold Schwarzenegger would carry or something. Well, it'd be very effective, yeah. <laughs> all jokes aside, the Landing Craft Museum is here to give visitors a real look at what war heroes experienced. This is real history. This is not Disneyland. This is the real thing. From the Landing Craft Support Museum in Vallejo, I'm John Bartel. Hope to see you on the back roads.